We need membership in organized industry. Organized industry has so much to offer. Uh, we can, can offer services that a, a new graduate would, would have a hard time trying to get done by himself or herself. Insurance, um, uh, practice placement for those that are looking for an associateship or an avenue of practice that uh, they would prefer. We offer camaraderie and we offer legislative lobbying in favor of our full membership, which would include our new graduates. Uh, we encourage joining us by allowing lower, a lower due structure for the first five years that a new graduate is, is um, out and pursuing whatever avenue they would like to help us have a united voice. And by that, I mean if dentistry, if our profession has a united voice for policymakers, we could have a dramatic effect on the direction that our profession is taking. I don't know if you're aware, but we do have um, an American Dental Student Association, which is a part of organized dentistry early on. Um, being involved as a student early on will allow the student to find out what's going on with, to, with the dental profession. Uh, we have students that go and serve on various committees at the state level and at the national level. And it, it gives them an insight and a perspective of what organized industry has to offer, number one. And number two, how they could contribute to what organized industry has to offer. And number three, how they would fare, which probably not be, would not be that well if they were not a member of organized industry because of what it would take, the, the, the effort that it would take. So I would just, um, advise a student that once they really did find an area of interest that organized industry could help them pursue that avenue and that would be in every respect to help them be able to manage finances for instance to to help with um, the debt structure after they graduate in order to be able to pursue that that avenue and organized industry is there to do that